Coming out shortly. In today's video, I'm going to cover how you can easily restore a deleted item within the system. Now, users within Sortly, as long as they have edit permissions, will have the opportunity to delete items within the system. Now, whether you have an employee who accidentally deleted something, or maybe someone who intentionally deleted something, not to worry, you can always restore that item at any point in time. Now, in this case, I'm going to work with this MacBook Pro as an example. To delete an item, you can click on the three dots here, and then you'll have the opportunity to delete this item. So if I hit delete here, it's going to ask me, are you sure you want to delete this item? In which case, in this example today, I will. So I'll hit delete. That's then going to delete that item from the system here specifically and push it over into the trash. Now, once this item has been deleted, it's going to move. It'll end up ultimately in the trash here. So in this middle column where you find your folder structure up at the top, at the very bottom of this tab, you're going to see the trash icon. If we click on the trash icon, it's going to pull you into your trash folder. Now, all of this data in here is going to be your existing items that have been in the trash. Keep in mind that items that are in the trash cannot be fully deleted from the system, so you can easily restore these items at any point in time. In today's example, we can either filter based on whether we want to see items or folders. So I can highlight just items in this case, since what I deleted was an item. There is also the opportunity to filter based off a specific date parameter. So if I go to today's date, I can click on the uh, apply option and it's going to show me the items that I've deleted in today's example. So here's that MacBook Pro that was deleted. If I hover over it, I can hit the restore option on the right hand side here, and that's going to bring that item back online to me for me in the initial folder that it was resided in. Now, keep in mind that any items that are in the trash can never fully be deleted, so they'll always exist in that panel. Once you've restored that item, you're going to get a little green banner at the bottom left, and we can jump back into the items tab where we should now be able to see that MacBook Pro, which was the initial item we deleted. Let me know if you have any additional questions. Thanks so much.